Good afternoon, everyone. I um, hope you're all having a great day. Um, welcome to group therapy. Um, we are going to be open here, so you know, don't be afraid to be open. I'm all ears. Melissa, why don't we start with you? Um, hi, um, I'm Melissa and this is my husband, James. And we have a bit of a problem. Elaborate. Seriously, it's not that big of a deal. Shit. Okay, so it wasn't that bad when he would just do it like in the house or when he was uncomfortable. When he walked down the aisle barefoot on our wedding day, at the ceremony in the church, I just, I couldn't. So your husband doesn't wear shoes. Yes, it is the right way to walk on the earth. Shut up! Anyway, I just can't deal with it anymore. Why does his condition bother you so much? Well, it all started when... How was your day? My day was good. I took a walk in the city. Without shoes? Uh, yeah. Previously on Monkey Fiesta. Clyde, did you forget the bread again? What can I say? I just forget bread. <laughs> Get in here, Donald Trump. <laughs> so I went on a date last night. James, Ooh. we have talked about this so many times. Ooh. You can't walk into the house with your feet like that. Oh, I read a marathon. What do you expect? I you have to wash your feet. It's normal. Why don't you just take a shower? Ugh. Can't you see why this is a problem? Can you fix him? I don't need no fixing. Ew! Uh... Oh my gosh. Oh. That's a stubborn one. Come on. Uh. Look, everyone has their preferences, and if those preferences aren't really harmful to others, we should allow the ones that we love to live their truth. But it's so. Let's move on. Dexter, why don't we delve into your issues? I feel like I have bad luck and just don't go my way, you know. When my dog got sick, um, his medical bills, it's just too much. I can't pay for it. Like, I don't want to say this, but I feel like funny. Oh my God, I'm so sorry we're late. I'm sorry, I was just hearing a man from his blindness. No, JC, you're stuck in traffic. Mother, why would you... Anyway, um... The past few weeks I've been feeling pretty depressed and... I feel like I need to sort out where these emotions are coming from and how I should do it. Anyway, Dr. Rubin, we think that you might be our only help and that we need help for my son. Why did you bring your son, JC, here today? Well, I... Uh, well, my mother claims to have an issue with the fact that I'm the second coming of Christ. Okay. Why exactly do you classify yourself as such? Well, there are many parallels between my life and the one of the original Jesus that lead me to believe that I was once him. Do you care to expand on this? Okay, well, to start, uh, my mother and the mother of Jesus Christ both bear the name Mary. My full name is Meredith, but I like to mother, go by Mary. Mother, please be quiet. I forgive you. Anyway, another thing that strikes me as evidence that I was once him is the fact that I never had a father that was on this earth. Jesse, I'm a lesbian. I told you. I forgive you. 
And anyway, after that, I decided to run a few experiments to test whether or not I was Jesus or not. And they all came across as a success to me. I forgive you. So for me, is there any advice that you could give? And now for my final bit of evidence. Okay, watch this. Hey, look at that bird. What? I don't see it. Uh, ta-da! You know, Mary, JC is on a journey of self-discovery, and his holy epiphany is just one step on that journey. You must allow him to find himself. But... Just accept it. And you, sir, what's your name? Dino Mike! Hiya, I'm Ken Green. I'm the Sir Monkey Fiesta, and I love my family. So, what brings you here today? I heard a therapist storyline would attract some more viewers. I'm sorry, but who is this chump? What? What JC said back there kind of rubbed me the wrong way. I might have to confront him about that. What was that? So, Ken, what are some of your hobbies? I just enjoy all the hijinks I get into with my pals. Greg, Biff, and Clyde. Okay, but what does that have to do with anything? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Saying oh and then a character's name is a new bit that writers on Monkey Fiesta wrote for me. I think it's pretty funny. Let's talk about some of your issues. We got canceled. Oh no. It's over. My whole family left. I'm done. <laughs> no! Wrong one! Aww. There. That's better. Hey, uh, Ken? Sorry, bud. I, uh, I completely understand how you feel. Um, my bug, uh, so okay, right. let's look at what we can do to, you know, really solve- Can I talk, please? I Today has like... been a pretty awesome experience. I enjoy hearing about the problems of others, and I learn a lot about myself. I have a crippling heroin addiction. You know! You guys don't even have real issues. I'm the one who needs help. You guys are just a bunch of freaks. My beloved show, Monkey Fiesta, just ended. What do you have to whine about? My husband doesn't wear shoes. You have the audacity to undermine our experience. Grow up! You know what? You're worse than Judas. Oh. Screw this! You're up here. Oh, ow! What is this uh, issue? Uh, you know, I'm not actually qualified to do this at all. I was a bit goofy. That was odd. Oh. Hey, do you have any of yes. that heroin? Yeah. Oh, thank yeah. God. All right. Jesus. What? Dino my. Not gonna lie, guys. I love movies. I also love music and other forms of art. Somna la haya, somna la haya, somna la haya.
poop. <laughs>